was a kid, I, I was always fascinated by the guys who were on the radio, the DJs at night. I remember when I was interning at a local station in Atlanta, how in awe I was of every single mechanic of the operation. I felt that and I thought if I could get to know everyone in that department and the next department and the other department that that would benefit me in some way later. So I tried to learn all different parts of the business. This is American Idol. I, mean, I really believed when I started American Idol we would get canceled after a season because that's what happened to shows. And then when we got a second season I thought this we've hit jackpot here. And then 14 years later I'm, I'm still doing it. Thank God. I would watch Merv Griffin and I would watch Dick Clark. He pulled me aside and he said, if they all think they can do it, you're doing a good job. It should look easy. And it's, it's not always that easy. It's true that there's some great opportunity afforded to you when you're in front of the camera. And so to be able to leverage that into something that is an asset to have to own for the future, I think is a smart lesson that I learned from him. The goals of, of the company are to create compelling content, to tell great stories. It's a really simple goal. We consume media all of the time. We're always on the go. Radio is with you in the car, in one app. Television is, is with you also on your phone, your tablet. So I think that to the extent that we're creating better quality content for all of these different outlets, that's where it's going. And I made an investment in a company called Digitors, which tours stars of YouTube and stars of Vines. And it's become a, a, a really successful touring operation. I think that part of our uh, agenda for the future is to continue to invest in things that are happening socially and in digital media. Seacrest Global Group is an investment fund to look at different companies in media. There's going to be a, a, a bigger need for that kind of marketing as time goes on to, to, to take the dollar further when it comes to marketing spendings and advertising spendings. Ryan Seacrest's distinction has been a lot of fun and I wanted to design something that could give guys who are starting out looking for their first suit or they're on the move to feel comfortable and confident in and we're wearing one now. This is it. I think as I look at the future I, I, I definitely see myself doing um, a little bit of everything, but a little less of everything. I like everything, but maybe just with lowercase letters, not capital letters.